morning everybody. Today I am telling cube roots. Before I am going, uh, before I tell cube roots, first I will tell you what are cubes. Cubes are nothing but into three. Okay. Now into three. What is into three? If any number, if there is a number seven. We need to multiply 7 3 times. Means we need to not do 7 into 3. We need to do 7 into 7 which is 49. Again into 7 the same number we are repeating 3 times. That is called cubes. The answer which we get is what? Cube. So let us see few examples. Now what is 1 square? 1 cube, 1 into 1 or into 1, if we multiply 3 times also we get 1. Now let's see, what is cube root of 5? 5 into 5 is 25. 25 into 5 is 125. So, 125 is the answer. 8 cube, 8 eighths, 64. 64 again into 8, 5 and 2. So, go. So, 10 cube is also 10 into 10, 100, 100 into 10 is something. Now, what are cube roots? We discussed about cube is into 3, any number uh, repeated 3 times. Root means what? Cube root means, now we have taken a number 79507. So, what is cube root for this? Now, how we did the formula I will tell now. Okay, that answer is cube root. We, we will get this we, in this number. First we have learned that a few numbers are here. Single digit. We are doing three times and getting the answer. Here we have got the answer and we need to find the question. Okay. So, 79507. How we will we find the cube root for this? First, we need to underline or we need to leave last three digits. 507. We need to leave that completely. Okay? We need to not count. Okay? Now, 79 is there. Now, what we will do is, we need most importantly, we need to remember only this table. Then cube roots is very easy for us. Okay? So, in this table, for explaining you are written inside. But at your books or at your maths uh, book questions, you won't uh, write this. Am I correct? So, you need to remember this table. You can note it and practice two, three times. Now, let's go. Now, 79 is there. We will leave 507 and 79 is there. We will check in the table where is 79. Where is 79? If you don't have 79, where it is nearest? In between. If 79 is between 4 and 5. 64 and 125. Am I correct? 79 is between 64 and 125. Means 4 and 5. So, 79 is between 64 and 125, 4 and 5. Now what we will do is, we will take the smaller number. Smaller number means 4 and 5 are there. Now which is smaller? 4 is smaller. So we will take 4. Now, my important thing is, we, we, first we need, I will tell you one thing. If 2 comes, we need to take 8. 3 comes, we need to take 7. 7 comes 3. 8 comes 2. Why? What is that? If you don't understand, must see this. Now, these are the big friends of each other. Okay? So, if it, the last of the question, 7, 9, 5, 0, 7, 9. 7, 7, 9, 5, 0, 8 becomes 
we need to write as 2. Why take this last digit normally? Now, after we find the 79s, okay, we will take the last, we will take the last digits. If it is 6, 6 means we don't have any big friend. So, we will take 6 as it is. But here it is 7. So, 7, if 7 comes at the last position, we need to take 3. If 8 comes, we need to take 2. Like that, if 2 comes 8, 3 comes 7, we need it to take to find the answer. Okay? So, 7, 9, 5, 0, 7. 79, we have uh, seen the 4. Now, here at the last digit, we have 7. Okay? 7 means, I have said you that we need to take 3. Okay? So, 7 came, we will write 4 beside 3. So, our answer is 43. Let's go to the next sum. So, our next sum is 17576. Before I tell this, I want to tell you one thing that some of you uh, will get the doubt of this big friend concept. So, I will explain you while going through this uh, sum. Okay? Now, 17576. How we will solve this sum? We needed to, I have told you at the first sum time, we needed to just take away the last three digits. Okay. See, if even we have four digit sum also, we need to take out the last three digits. At the last one number also, here two is there with one number. Here one is there with one number. Like that two also, with four numbers also, we need to take away three digits. And one more thing, that the three, three uh, numbers won't be in cube roots. Okay. If three numbers are taken away, nothing will be remaining. So that's one. At minimum four. So let's go to sum. One, seven, five, seven, six. How we will solve this? As I have said, we need to take last three digits. We will get 17. So we need to check in this table. Is 17 correctly there? Or at in between? Now, if uh, here is not 17, think. If here is 27, here 27 is there. So we will write 3. That I will explain you in the next sum. Okay. So first we have 17. 17 is in between of 2 and 3. 8 and 27. It is in the between. Not correctly between. Just in the between numbers, it is there. 8 and 27, it is between. Now we will take the smaller number, the smaller number is 2. We will take. So next what we will do? Now I will explain you the different smart friend concept. So, 2873. Most of people will get confusion here. Most of people not you, not you. Okay? I'll tell you this one. So, big friend. So, actually, see in my first video, okay, what is big friend, I would uh, tell in my next video. 2 and 8 are big friends. Okay? 2 and 8 are big friends. In Abacus. Method I'm telling, okay. It will be easy for you in Abacus method, okay. So seven and three are big friends. Two and eight, seven and three. Am I clear till now? Now, if we get in a sum two. We need to write 8. Why do you need to write 8 mic? Because it is the big friend. For any number you see, 6 or 